Hi everyone, I'm excited to be on Facebook Live today to have a brief chat with you about Jobberman and what we are doing for seekers as well as some recruiters. Jobberman, you might have heard we are the place to come to for jobs and also for recruiters for your HR solutions. Essentially today I would seek to interact more with you, listen to your questions, try and answer some of your questions as well as suggestions that you might have for us. These are the things that helps us to grow and to also develop new products and services that suit and match your preferences. At Jobberman, we are customer focused and we will ensure that we do have such interactions to hear more from you. I'll essentially start talking about Take Control, which is a campaign that we are running for you seekers and should I say talents out there that we seek to place in jobs. Take control essentially is about you taking control of your career, having control of the entire recruitment process and also being informed and branding yourself better to get the best out of your career. We've done this through different means and at Jobberman, as you would know, we rely heavily on technology to solve problems. Take control helps you to track your applications it also helps you to have a fair idea of your job listings. You might have heard recently that Jobberman has upgraded our website, and that's also in line with our Take Control campaign. On our new website, you can sign up if you're not already a member of the Jobberman um, platform. You can also upload your profile, as in your CV, or you can have your CV by you and improve your profile details. It's essential that you do have more details on your profile. One of the questions I had earlier is about people not having enough um, applications coming through or not being called after they've applied for jobs on our page. This is essentially because you might have not had a lot of your details or information on your profile. What happens at Jobberman is that we have over 100,000 CVs on our database. The more information we have about you, then we are much more prepared to see your CV coming up as part of the top 20, top 15 to be reviewed and submitted for interviews with recruiters. So I urge all of you who are, who are yet to be called to essentially improve your profile by updating it with more information about you. If you need your CV reviewed, you can also talk to us about at Jobman. And on CV writing services that we offer, Today, I will be generous and bringing information and I'm also coming up here with goodies. So what's happening is I'm going to offer the first 15 people who join in, just show me a thumbs up on our comment session, and then we'll give you a 50% discount on our CV writing services. On our CV writing services, we essentially help you to brand yourself on paper to be recognizable and marketable to the recruiter that you want to work for. Also, please, please, please call somebody, text somebody, WhatsApp somebody, tell them that it's time to get to know more about Jobberman, it's time to interact with Jobberman, and the CEO is live on Facebook. So they should come to our page, the Jobberman Ghana official page, verify you see the tick sign on our logo, and they should enjoy the chat. I'm here for them. Now, Talking much more about our new website, we do have, as I said, the sign-up section where you have to update your profiles. You need also to explore the page where now we have featured jobs. We have job categorization, which means that you have jobs by profession. So you have accounting jobs, you have finance jobs segmented solely for you to make it easy for you to be able to access our listings. We also have jobs by sectors, which is an improvement for your search purposes. We also have smart job search, so you can type in a keyword and see all up updated jobs on that keyword. So if you are an investment analyst, you can just type investment analyst and you see jobs listed in that category. We also do have dashboards where you can track your applications. And to mention about dashboards, I encourage you to go on to your Play Store where you'd also see a Jobberman app, Jobberman Ghana app coming up on Play Store for Android users. You can sign up, download, put in your 
um, login essentials, just the same thing as you do on our web page, and you have it on your phones. Now, also as part of our website, we do have a lighter website, so you shouldn't be scared of staying too much on our website. A lighter website means that it takes just a little bit of your data, just as you take control of your career. On our website, you find our interesting job blocks, which you can learn from. If you have comments, you have topics that you want us to guide you on in terms of career, career counseling, you can also put those in the comment section of our job blocks. It's interactive, we'll listen, we'll come back with articles that suit you. A bit more questions and thanks, Solomon Pong. Solomon Pong, thanks. He um, you said you've applied but not received any offer till now. So yeah, Solomon, this one issue, I think I have some questions earlier about that as well. What happens is at Job Man, we have over 100,000 CVs in our database. So you can imagine how competitive it will be to pick out the first 20 for a particular role. What happens is the more you update your profile with enough information, information is simply putting things about your expertise, your skill set, your latest um, email addresses and your contact details. This then pushes you up in terms of your brand value. And then we can always see you as part of the top 20 who have completed their profiles and then you record. In terms of our upcoming projects and events as well, we listen to you as I said, and we try to bring services and products that suit your need. So recently what we've done is we fed you, we, know have, we were not having enough um, services suited for seekers and you wanted training. That was one thing I had from my Twitter interaction a couple of months ago. So coming up in this quarter, we've designed a training which is based on our research findings of recent recruitment trends. What I mean by that is of every 100 marketing placements that we have, over 70 of them request for digital marketers. The world is going technology based and now marketing is not just moving around offline, but also digital marketing. And that's what institutions are looking out for. So coming up in this quarter on our social media platforms, you see us advertising for digital marketing training, just to make sure that seekers are well equipped, they get the necessary um, training so that they can get roles that um, recruiters are looking out for. And there was also another question earlier, which um, from Gifty, I think on one of our ads about the Facebook Live, and she was asking about the trends as in parents and families not having enough time for their children and that affecting communication for young ones coming up. Yes, at Bujopama, we do run such similar research and our last research on um, the best places to work in Ghana showed clearly that em employees, that's people who are already employed, look out for these things, which they look out for certain things, which encourages them to choose one job or the other to, or to find out, to, or to, to have a perception that one job is better than the other. And one clear point was flexible working hours as well as um, proximity to your office premise. So that should be key for recruiters or for employers who want to attract the top talents. What it means is that employees or top talents are looking for companies that would allow them to work sometime at home, work from anywhere because of the computer and the internet, and also companies that have means of transportation so they can go to and fro from work easily. All this is in line for, for young middle income earners to have time for their family as they grow their career as well. Thanks, Ajua. Thanks, uh, Mami Dufi. What is happening is that we would be noting down your names, you'd be qualifying for the 50% CV writing services and we'll contact you from our official inbox and then we'll show you on the processes to follow for that service. Also, one of our upcoming events is a campus tour where we 
we'll be visiting different campuses. What we'll be doing is to counsel students, both those graduating and those in continuing um, years. We'll be sharing experiences from different sectors, new trends in terms of career per industry. If you're working in the, if you want to go into the banking industry with the trends in the financial sector and all that, what and how should you position yourself? We'll be having those career guidance during our campus tour. And for some of the campuses, we'll also be having internship slots where we would give opportunities for students to get hired, have an interview on the sport and get hired on the sport for interviews. We've done this in the past and I can assure you that some people can have, some people have good reviews of those, those opportunities given. Internship is a way to gain experience as a job seeker even before you start your, your national service. Thanks, Jill. Um, your question is about my opinion on gender and pay gap. Yes. Per our research as well in the industry, we recognize that of the number of people that we surveyed, most of those who are highly paid were men. And not just highly paid, but also most of those who were in C-level management positions were men. So yes, it's a reality which is existing, but also there is, there is a compensation to be made in, in the sense that with the survey that we had, we noticed that the gap is not as, as wide as perceived. If you compare CEOs from different organizations irrespective of the agenda, the gap is being closed, as in women are being paid for their worth. And it's one that we encourage. You need to brand yourself irrespective of your gender, and you need to be paid irrespective of your gender. It's, and it's one agenda that we will be pushing up. Thanks, um, Lofty, as well, for the thumbs up, and you qualifying as well for the 50% discount. Also, one other thing that we're doing in terms of enriching our engagement and our interaction and trying to develop seekers or talents as which will help us to get the right talent to recruit us is our upcoming radio show. We will be announcing soon the exact date for that radio show, which will be on 3FM. It's a partnership between us and the group and it's, it's called the Career Hub with Jobberman. So the Career Hub with Jobberman again will be talking we'll be having some career guidance we have an industry experts and the surprise package will be live radio interviews. So watch out for the radio show, which is the career hub with Jobberman. Get notified as to which interview will be had for which role, which position, prepare, send your CVs via email beforehand, and then you can just phone in and take part in a live radio interview where you can get hired. So watch out for that as seekers. We also have what we call the um, the job seeker premiums, and that's an added-on service which we provide at Jobberman for seekers. What happens is that as you improve your profile listing, as you improve your data on your profiles, you do qualify then to have certain activities or certain features as part of your, your dashboard when you go onto your profile on our website or on the app. Some of the features that you would be enjoying includes job matching, which means that we'll look at the data that you've put on your profile, if the skills, the experience, and you'll be getting featured jobs on your dashboard which match those um, experiences and skills. So you didn't have to talk to be searching for jobs that match your skills and be going through the whole listing that we do provide on our website, but you'd be automatically matched. You also enjoy application generation where you have templates easy for you to complete and generate your application. You also have an application confirmation where you have confirmation, confirmed application receipts. So you can save those and say, I have keep track of the applications you've made over time or through your profile on our website or on our app. You would also have application tracking system, which also helps you to keep track and you'll be notified of the stage at which you are in terms of your application. So what happens is if your, your, your CV has been taken by a recruiter, you'll be notified. If 
you're, you've been shortlisted after the interview, you've been notified, and so on and so forth. Um, Adama Christian, you asking that why do companies normally prefer women for the role of office assistants? Um, certain roles do come with certain services that or certain duties in terms of the job description. And from my experience in reviewing a lot of these job descriptions, a lot of the things that may be required for office administrative assistance role is much more easily um, performed by, by ladies. But in today's trends, men, I've, I've, I've met men who are also office assistants and also personal assistants. We used to have a lot of females being personal assistants as well. But these days, I can assure you, some men are also delving into that aspect. So it's basically because of the job descriptions that come with such roles. Thank you, um, Lana Kopna Yuboa and Esther Arthur as well. You also earn the 50% discount on your job CVs, your CV writing. So you can, you'll, you'll be contacted, as I said, and then your CVs will be written at 50% discounts. Um, also, there are lots of things that go on on our, on our social media pages, that's the Facebook, our LinkedIn, and our Twitter accounts. There are daily things that go on. So the job blog that we write in terms of career guidance things would also be linked to our social media pages. You can follow us through there. You can also have relaxing moments where we share some jokes to ease up your day in terms of jobs. We share a lot of tips tips to manage your stress, tips to manage relationships between you and your superiors, tips to prepare you for interviews, and even tips in writing your CVs. So do follow us on all our social media pages for that. Um, Littlefield Angel, I'm in Qatar now. I've sent so many applications to this site, but I haven't received any reply yet. So yes. Little Angel, as I said before, first of all, we do have different kinds of jobs listed on our, on our platform. We do have a huge database of CVs as well. And as I was encouraging seekers to do, one, you need to first write a good CV, which I hope you have and branded yourself well in that CV. On our platform, if you've registered, Please make sure that your details, your contact details are up to date. Your profile is completed, which means that a lot of thing, the things that you have in your good CV, you need to bring them to bear on your profile on our web page. Because the first point of call for us in recruitment is go to our database and pull out those who match the experience and skill set required by our recruiters. And then we do call them subsequently. So please do those tips. You can inbox us if you have any challenges and would we'll address those for you as well, Little Field Angel. Thanks, Abna Ejakwa Ochiridakun as well for joining. And I'll still be waiting for more questions to interact with you because this is more like listening to you, trying to hear what you want more from us. And like I said, the first training coming up is a digital marketing training. We would be looking out as well for more, um, based on our research on other things required by recruiters, other specific areas required by recruiters to give um, you training sessions on that. Because we want to prepare the seekers adequately so we we'll have talented seekers going to the companies and giving us good reviews in turn. And one, one other thing is that I, I job a man for seekers, which is one thing I want to talk about is that any, anywhere you see a job a man job listing, whether on our WhatsApp platform or our social media platform or on our website, job a man do not charge seekers to post them or to give them jobs. Again, at job a man, we do not take money from seekers to give them jobs. It's free. And our, our business model does not entail us collecting monies from job seekers to position them. Few occasions we've seen people share um, WhatsApp messages and they put different brands under there 
and names under the under the adverts and others and ask that you send money through mobile money, etc. But no job man will never charge you. We are currently not charging. The future will not charge you to give you a job placement. All you need to do is be on our profile, upload your data, and then you would be called and an interview arranged and then you get your role. Um, Abnai Jakwa Ochidaku says, Jeff, please still waiting for an opportunity. How long should I? I've now I'd encourage you to, to keep the hope alive, complete your complete your profile. Make sure, please, please make sure you've completed your profile. Why I'm insisting that seekers complete their profile is that I've had success stories in recent times where people complained. We counseled them to complete their profile. And in a week, two weeks, they had job calls, they had interview sessions and they were surprised. So please, please ensure that your profile on Jobberman is completed with a lot of data, be 90%, have your profile 90%, 95% completed, and then definitely, I'm sure you'd get a call from us soon. Charles Denu says, please, when are you having financial modeling training? Charles, ask, ask them when we do get, we do see a particular trend in financial modeling from recruiters, the, the exact aspects of financial model that they require, the exact um, topics that they require, then we'll come out with that topic so that we we'll make seekers marketable in terms of what recruiters want. So keep up with us, be on our social media page, Charles, and we'll keep you informed on our financial topics based on what recruiters are looking out for. Benu Mutuma, um, how does the professional CV service solution work, how can it help me? So mainly what happens is that we do have CV writing services. I don't know if, but I'll confirm later if you're part of the first 15, I've seen your thumbs up. Hopefully if you're part of the first 15, then you get a 50% discount on CV writing service. So what happens is we'll contact you, we'll have you email your CV to us, we'll review it for you, we'll show you, which aspects we think are not professional, would indicate to you how we think you should brand yourself, ask you questions, because your CV should be about you. Our experience is that we've seen people write CVs, and when you ask them questions, it seems the CV personality is different from the actual person. So what we're going to do is that we would call you as well, interact with you, and make sure that your CV is you, Benu, and also it brands you well and puts you ahead of the curve when we are looking for posts or roles for a position. And that would help you a lot because, for instance, if you are looking to buy a commodity, you would obviously go for one which is well branded and has good reviews. So once we have a good branded CV from you, Menu, it would help you to get a place in terms of job. Um, Littlefield Angel, please do you, do you have ITC Nebush training? Um, again, on the training training models that we do run, it's all based on what the recruiters are looking out for in a particular season or what we notice from our research and our listings, what we discover that the recruiters are looking for. So when it gets to the point that recruiters are demanding for this training, IGC in the bush will definitely look at that um, little field angel. Um, yeah, so yes, on the Nebush training, does it, or any of the health and safety training as well. Okay, yes, we, we, we will look at what is being demanded for health and safety training and also we'll keep you informed on our social media um, handles in terms of upcoming trainings on health and safety. So, little angel, please look out for us and, and keep following us and you'd get your training soon. Currently, most of the trainings we are running are offline, that means as our premise. We're looking at adding learning models also to our website. So watch out for that, where you can just sit in the comfort of your homes and learn from our platforms. How much do we charge for reviewing your CV for you? Caesar Selassie. So Caesar, what happens is, if you happen to be a student and you are following us on our social media page, what would happen is that you'd see an announcement on our social media page when we plan to come to your campus or a campus near you. 
on campuses, we do have our CV experts there who would basically review and give you comments, just comments for free. And then if you want them to assist you to rewrite it, you can come over or you can send us a request via emails or on our social media platform and we'll follow through with that. For days like this where I'm generous, I've given 50% discount. On campuses as well, we do have campus prizes. So Caesar, just inbox us and then we would see if you're a student, if you're a graduate, you just look at your position, what you need, and then we'll give you the price that suits you because our CV services are in different packages. But do inbox us and we'll gladly help you. Um, Jill, apart from completing my profile on Doberman, how else can I optimize profile for maximum visibility? Jill, I'll encourage that. Again, I'll speak a bit more about um, personal branding. It's, it's one of the courses that we do run from time to time. And in case any of you come across it and you have time, I'll encourage that you do join us for that, that course. Personal branding is key because as what you put in terms of your profiling so updating your profile with much more information about you is not just putting in words and skills and experiences that you have but what is the new name for that skill that you are looking at for are you into marketing what is the current trend in marketing I, what do you know about digital marketing that means that somebody who is looking for a digital marketer would then have your cv pop up but if you just say you're a marketing person and the person puts in digital marketing and all other digital marketing people who have their CVs pop up, whilst yours will be secondary and will be way behind the queue. So as you update your profile, aside that, I think in optimizing your profile and maximizing visibility, clearly brand yourself, put relevant um, experiences and skills that are needed in today's job world, and then you'd get your visibility required. Samuel Opon, um, please can you send us a template to guide us to complete our profile? Okay, what we can assist you do is we do have um, a sort of um, um, help guide on how our new website goes, but we'll do we'll send steps sub subsequently on our social media pages and also we'll have our tax my blog team to prepare a blog on how to help you update and have the right profile because it's important. So some will watch out on our social media for um, our social media pages and also on our blog for steps on how to complete your profile and also a bit of some tips on branding yourself in terms of updating your profile. Isaac, Isaac Numun. We'd like to know much more about the CV writing. So Isaac, yes, um, again, would, would, I'd ask that you send your request directly through our inbox, but what I can tell you now is we've, over time, based on the over 100,000 CVs that we have in our database, we've noticed the common errors that exist that people do have. Frequently from time to time, we do see similar errors and mistakes coming up as people upload their CVs mainly because we do take CVs off the shelf from the internet. We do not customize it to suit our career or our positions. So a CV that you might prepare for an entry level is not the same CV that you prepare for a managerial role. In the same way, a CV that you might prepare for an engineering role will not be the same CV you prepare for a marketing role. So all those are some aspects that we do look out for. And I encourage that you send us an inbox message and we'll give you some tips. Also, please, everybody, all seekers, just keep up with our, our Jobberman blog. We do have regular tips on CV writing and not just that, but also interview skills. Thanks, Thelma. And you're asking, are there internship opportunities available on our website? What we do is we do reserve most of our internship slots for our campus people those on, on the campuses. So as part of our campus tour, we do run uh, live, in, live interviews and immediate internship um, hiring on most of our campuses. We've done that at UPSA, we've done that at the NIT campus fairs amongst others. And students there can attest to the experiences they had having internships. Um, 
Lofty, when is the digital marketing program coming on? So Lofty, you you can go through, scroll down our page on Facebook, you see the link that helps you to register online. The training is scheduled for 23rd of October. You can register online through the link or you can just send us a message into our inbox after the Facebook Live and then we'll get, I'll get my team to respond and help you register. So it's 23rd of October, 2019. It's just a few weeks away. Charles Zenu, I highly recommend Jobberman. I got my previous role in a pension house through Jobberman. It's real. Thanks, thanks, Charles. And it's good to have such um, testimonials from people who have used their platform. Um, although you've had your first job, Charles, I can assure you that in your career progress, in your career progression, you should still keep up with Jobberman. We'll be looking at helping you to go to the next level and help you climb up to your managerial position that you've dreamed of. So keep on updating your profile, letting us know your new roles, your new work, new things that you're doing, new skills you've acquired, so that we can grow up or we can join you or hold hands with you on the journey as you progress in your career, Charles. Thanks very much. Gift to you. It says, please, how well prepared is the modern corporate world? Um, the modern corporate mother, how much provision is made for the corporate mother to breastfeed her child in work environments when she resumes work after three months? Um, that's a long one. And Gifty is a speech therapist and has seen issues. Yes, so I think this is one of the questions I had before coming through before the Facebook session. Um, Gift is true, and I was. I indicated earlier that based on our research that we've had on 100 best places to work in Ghana, which you'll find on our web pages, and also I'm sure the link is down there on our page as well. In that document, we discovered what people look out for in terms of job places that are satisfying or good for them. And one of the key things was um, flexible working hours. For some of the ladies who joined in our survey, we also discovered that such amenities as um, friendly working environments for parents who have delivered or women who have delivered. And I can assure you that surprisingly, I didn't know this, but through the survey, I discovered that there are companies in Ghana who have um, facilities that you're, you're, you're describing as in maternity, um, maternity assisted facilities, if I may put it that way. So, and I'm not, I'm not advertising them yet, but I'll ask that you review the, you read our comments as well. Uh, sorry, our, our survey reports on the 100 best places. And you'd, see, you'd, be, you'd be surprised or pleasantly surprised that some companies are doing well. And we continue to educate or encourage institutions to create better um, working environments because it's, it's, it helps people to work effectively. It helps people to be happy. And when they are happy, they're able to give their best. So yes, there are a few companies doing that and we continue to educate and encourage other companies to do that as well. And more especially, it's essential for the young middle-aged people that we are trying to encourage um, into our job settings because we're going, we going digital, we're going technology-based. It's these young people who are ready to carry the digitalization into our institutions. So what happens is that these same young people are now setting up their families, they are now giving birth, et cetera, and they will require these facilities. So flexible working hours, which is key, that means that you will allow a day or two for people to work from home, have systems in place that can help them to um, optimize their workflow and others, and also create enough friendly environment for parents who have just delivered. Um, so thank you, Gifty, for, for, that, for that question. Um, Clements Abdul Rashid, I've been trying to change my profile details, but I still received job alert on my previous qualification. What do I have to do? So, James, what I, what I would encourage you to do is that ensure that not just your emails and your contact that has been changed or improved, but try and add up to your grade. So, what I, what I mean by that is if you had a BSc in a particular course, and now you have a postgraduate in that, please do indicate that. 
indicate the new skill sets you've been working with and not just what was in your previous CV. And feel free anytime to inbox us with questions if you're having technical challenges with our website in terms of updating, and we'll do that. What I foresee happening is probably most of your skill sets that you have on your profile is based on your previous CV. So please, please update with new skill sets that you've acquired. Ensure that um, you have experiences to match those, and then you would you would you have new um, career that suits you throwing up or coming up to you. Thank you very much. Um, thank you, Gifty, as well. Good question, and um, thank you, new committee, Ashon. Um, Lofty, when is the digital marketing program coming up? So, Lofty, yes, the digital program is coming up on. Um, 23rd of October, you'll be at the Jobama New Premise adjacent Fiesta across the N1. And um, like I said, we do have registration documents on our social media pages. So after the Facebook Live, you can scroll down, you see the adverts, you see a link, and then you can register. If you're having challenges, you can inbox us with any questions and we'll promptly respond to that. Thanks, Edward Sari. Um, I've been enjoying this, this much, but I've been prompted that I do have barely 15 minutes to go. So I'll be taking a few more questions as I summarize up what I've been saying about our new trends, new things that we are doing at Jobberman Ghana. So yes, Jobberman Ghana is a customer-focused institution. We We'll try and do this often to listen to you, to discover what you want us to offer to you, and to also answer questions and issues that you might be having challenges with. Um, we also improving daily, we've improved our websites, and I mentioned that we've improved it just to suit you, to make your search easier, to make it faster, to make it lighter also, so you don't have to spend too much data in downloading and browsing through our pages. So now when you go onto our pages, just relax, take your time, your data will not fly away. Enjoy all that we have and offer you on there because we have we offer a lot in terms of career advice on our Jobberman blog. Look onto your Play Store as an Android user also and download our Jobberman Ghana app where you can sign up or put in your profile details, login details, and all the information you have on our website will essentially be on there. You would enjoy other dashboard activities or features that come with this. Some are also on our main website that you can enjoy, including the application tracking, the job matching, the improved um, application generation, and, applic and also on our app, you can save your applications. Um, Kojo Nyaku. Thanks, thanks, thanks for appreciating us, Kojo Nyaku. Um, we'll continue to, to satisfy our clients. We'll continue to interact with you to be able to deliver the best for you. Um, Marian, please, are there jobs available for SHS graduates on Jobberman? I've been searching, but I'm not sure. I'm not searching well, or they are just not available. So, um, Marian, I can assure you that we, most of the jobs that we do have Based, are based on requirements from the recruiters or the employers. And you'd have a lot of them per data or statistics available from, to me. Most of the jobs available are for degree holders, diploma holders. There will be, there, there are few on there which do not require diploma or degrees which you can look out for. But again, as I would encourage you to do, complete your profile, or they are an SHS graduate, I'm sure you have skills and other experiences that could be brought to bear in any organization. And as a talent, we would ask you that you update your profile with all those skills and experiences and you'll be called. Because I've, I've seen people hired for positions and roles who are also SHS graduates. So fill your profile, update your profile details. And like I explained, in our new, on our new website, we have the job matching, which will then help you. So the first thing I'll say is to make the search easier, update your profile with enough information about you. Um, uh, 
for those for those who would want to have questions answered and because of time I will not be able to do so. I'm sure the video would be live on our Facebook page and subsequently you can review it. You can look at it again. You can also ask questions that you couldn't ask live via our inbox, our Facebook inbox, or you can send us a comment on our WhatsApp page if you have our WhatsApp number or any of our other social media pages that's on LinkedIn and on Twitter and on Instagram. You can also send emails to us on our info at jobberman.com.gh email address. For those inquiring about CVs and all those who had thumbs up, I would say that you should send us a message with your email addresses on via our inbox. We'll get back to you and would we'll require that you send us your CVs in whichever form, and then we'll continue from there with your 50% discount. Kwesi um, Nate, I want to enroll in environmental health and safety course. Nebosh, can I know when you do that in Ghana? So now, yes, we, we, we're getting a lot of requests for the Nebosh course. And so, Nate, Kwesi, please keep following us. And in terms, of, especially on our social media pages, you'd have an information soon about the time that would organize the health and safety course. Because I, I could see earlier there were questions on that. There are questions now, and then would we'll also would we'll also look at what recruiters are looking out for, especially in the environmental health and safety space and then we'll come up with a training for that so not a please follow keep following us on our social media pages thank you very much so for all those in campuses and universities i would encourage that you do follow us also i'm reminding you about our campus tour which will be coming up this quarter come listen get advice on career whether you're in the banking space and you want to just solely do accounting, things are going fintech and you should need um, an advice on where the financial sector is going. If you are into sciences, engineering, come listen, have a career person talk to you about what changes are taking place in that sector. And also, like I always encourage, once you're in your university and you have vacations, just try and have an internship every three months of every year. So by that in four years, you have had four internships of three months, which is 12 months in essentially, you would have had one year of experience before you graduate. You add that to your national service experience and by the time you finish national service, you'd have had two years of work experience. Now with that on your CV, I can assure you that you'd be ahead of a lot of people when it comes to entry level applications. So don't wait till it's late. You can start right from level 100, enjoying internships and just follow us on our social media pages to know when we are coming close to a campus near you or when we are on your campus specifically. Like I said, you can still keep up with questions coming in through our social media inboxes and comments on our social media pages and also at our email address info at jobberman.com.gh. It's just info at jobberman, Ghana, jobberman.com.gh. Watch out also for our radio show, Career Hub, which will be on 3FM. It will be on Mondays during their morning show. As I said, we'll be announcing the roles available and we'll have monthly live radio interviews. So just Keep your ears open when we start and then be watching out for which role you would love to have interview had on, on, on live video. Twenty-third October is our live uh, digital marketing training, which is the last thing I want to talk about. So for those in marketing space, whether you're working whether you're not working and you want to have a career in digital marketing, as I said earlier, of 100 jobs that you'd have in terms of marketing, the recruiters are looking for digital marketers. The internet is a place to sell. And even if you have your own business and you want to sell, 
I would advise that you need to take part in this digital marketing training, where we would be training you and giving certificates as well. So I still have nine minutes more to hang out with you here. And I want to finish by talking a bit more about the, the take control campaign that we're running for seekers. It's essential that you take control of your career and in taking control of your career, you need to be more responsible in terms of your recruitment, um, the recruitment process. So at Jobberman, we're giving you that opportunity, fill up your profile, sign up, fill up your profile, take control of the recruitment process by knowing when um, your CV is taken up, knowing when you're scheduled for an interview, et cetera, getting updated on, if, in, on information in terms of the job space, getting updated in terms of information on career guidance, and also getting regular training from Jobman for roles or for courses that recruiters are looking for and skills that recruiters are looking for. So you need to take control of your career by joining Job Jobberman. If you're not signed up, sign up. If you signed up, please, please, please update your profile. Keep following us for regular information as well. You would receive job, job alerts, you would, you would enjoy our dashboards, and you would also have your application tracking, or whether you're on our websites, regular websites, or you, are, you access us through the Android um, app that we have on App Store. I'm willing to take a few more questions as my time draws to a close. So for all who required um, environmental health and safety training, yes, we've noted that. And as we listen to you, we'll plan out something for that. So do keep following us on our social media platform. And for those who are in Accra, in case you want to pop into our office and have a discussion about your CVs as well, you can come visit us. We are now closer to you. We are adjacent to the Fiesta Royal Hotel, Joel Junction, um, across the N1 from Fiesta. You see a welcoming banner on the building, the Apex building. You can use the side road, not on the main N1, but the side road and visit us. You're always welcome. Thelma is asking, well, who a good candidate is? Yes, who a good candidate is? So essentially, a good candidate is one that has the, the experience and the skills which matches what the recruiter is looking out for. Notice it's not just about the number of years of experience, but what the recruiter is looking out for. So if a recruiter is looking out for somebody in the marketing space with essentially digital marketing um, experience. The person should have that skill set, one, and the person should have an experience in that particular um, field or that skill set. And also the person should be one who fits within what is required for that team. So you should also watch out for other products that will come up with which help seekers to essentially get to know themselves in terms of their um, their personalities. Because in deciding who joins what team, which person the recruiter chooses to join their team, you should be able to have a fair idea of your personality and whether you are needed or you'll be able to be part of the team. So a good candidate for Telma, your answer is that have the right skill sets, have the right experience, 
and have the right personal attributes that would enable you to be part of the team. Thanks, Gilbert, as well. So thank you very much. As I conclude, I've, I've had a lovely time. I've enjoyed every bit of it. I will definitely be back here and probably come back with more goodies, not just 50% CV services, but watch out for our next um, interaction. I've enjoyed it, as I said, and that means that I'll definitely come back some time soon again to come and interact with you. But in between that time, please feel free anytime to contact us using our inboxes on here on our social media pages, LinkedIn, Twitter, and Instagram. And also, when we start our radio show on 3FM, Career Hub with Jobberman Mondays on the morning, on the morning breakfast program, feel free to call in to ask questions to partake in that as well. Boom. There's a question from Nana Chrissy. Um, please, does government change money, charge money to help job seekers find jobs? So yes, I, I said that earlier that please, job man, a job man, we do not charge job seekers. We never charge job seekers to help them find a job. We've never done that. We are not doing that now and we will not do that in the future because we recognize that job seekers are not yet having regular incomes and they cannot afford that. So we are not doing that. In case you see any adverts, any text or WhatsApp stating that Jobberman has a role and you need to send money to a mobile money number or an account or anything, please, it's a fraudulent um, listing, it's a fraudulent message, it's not coming from Jobberman. Jobberman Ghana does not charge for finding roles for people, for job seekers. So thank you, Nana Chrissy, for that question again. Thank you very much, everybody. Like I said, I've enjoyed this, every bit of this. I've enjoyed the questions. I've enjoyed the comments. I've learned as well. That's a long message from Gifty by Lens and in-house we do try to keep up with uh, flexible working hours and good conditions and it's one that would encourage recruiters. If you're a recruiter, you're a small scale um, enterprise business owner, Jobberman has a service for you. So we don't just deal with big organizations, branded organizations who have trusted us and trust our brand, but we do also work and help and assist um, SMEs to find the right talents to grow. What we do is we are the only organization who I can promise you hire the right talents for you between two to five days. That's what we call quick recruit. You don't need to wait a month to have the right talents when you have when you're losing money or you're bleeding. And I can encourage you that when you come to job man as a recruiter or an employer, between two to five days, we'll find that talent based on 100, over 100,000 CVs available in our network with um, seekers that we've developed over time since they were in university and we do have relationships with and we'll find that talent for you. So for seekers, please do call in to us anytime for job, for, for career um, counseling, for information, for training services, for employers as well, whether you're a big organization, whether you're a small organization, we do have time for you. We care for our customers and we would always listen to what you want us to do for you. Thank you very much and I hope to see you all soon. Bye.